USS Luzon was an internal combustion engine repair ship that saw service in the United States Navy during World War II. She was the lead ship in a class of 12 and was named for the island of Luzon, the chief island in the northern Philippines and site of the capital city of Manila. She is the second U.S. naval vessel to bear the name. Luzon was laid down April 8, 1943, as Liberty Ship SS Samuel Bowles, under a Maritime Commission contract, MCE Hall 981, by the Bethlehem Fairfield Shipyard Inc. In Baltimore, Maryland, launched May 14, 1943, Sponsored by Mrs. H. E. Sigmund, acquired by the Navy and renamed Luzon May 24, 1943, commissioned October 12, 1943, with Commander Elmer R. Runquist, in command. After shakedown in Chesapeake Bay, she departed Norfolk, Virginia 28 November, for duty in the Pacific. She transited the Panama Canal 6 December, and arrived the Ellis Islands January 3, 1944. Assigned to Service Squadron 4, she operated at Funafuti and provided repair facilities for amphibious, patrol, and landing craft. Following the invasion of the Marshall Islands on 31st of January, she steamed for Kwajalein Atoll on 23rd of February, and arrived there on 4th of March. During the next five months, she served there as repair ship and tender for harbor craft. As American sea power spearheaded the Allied advance across the Pacific, Luzon steamed to Guam after the conquest of the Marianas. Departing Kwajalein on 2nd of September, she sailed via Aniwatok and reached Apra Guam, on 11th of September. As a unit of Service Squadron 10, she maintained a busy repair schedule there until March 1, 1945, when she steamed to Saipan for six months of duty at that important harbor. Following the surrender of Japan to the Allied powers, Luzon departed the Marianas on 1st of October, for Japanese waters. After touching at Iwo Jima, she reached Wakanura Wan, Honshu on 8th of October. She proceeded to Nagoya, Honshu, 19th of December until 22 December. She provided fleet and repair services to ship supporting occupation operations in Japan. She then departed for the United States, and, after touching at Pearl Harbor and the Panama Canal, she arrived at Orange, Texas, on February 9, 1946. Assigned to the Atlantic Reserve Fleet, she was decommissioned on June 24, 1947. In response to the outbreak of the Korean War, Luzon was recommissioned on September 20, 1950, Commander Allen B. Sutherland in command. After steaming to Norfolk in early in October, she departed for the West Coast on 15 November. She reached San Diego on 6 December, proceeded to San Francisco on 11 December, and sailed for the Far East on 26 December. She arrived at Sasebo, Kyushu on January 23, 1951, and during the remainder of the year, she provided valuable repair services for ships of the U.S. 7th Fleet. She departed Japan for the West Coast January 19, 1952. After reaching San Francisco on 9 February, she operated out of San Francisco, San Diego, Pearl Harbor, and Long Beach during the next 15 months. Departing Long Beach on May 2, 1953, Luzon deployed to the Western Pacific and arrived at Sasebo on 2 June. Except for a run to Pusan, South Korea, and back in mid-July, she provided repair facilities at Sasebo until sailing to Yokosuka on January 15, 1954. She departed the Far East for home on 2 February, and arrived at Long Beach on 28 February. She was placed in commission, in reserve on March 15, 1955, while undergoing repair at Mare Island. After returning to San Diego on 29 April, she was placed in service, and reserve. Luzon was recommissioned at San Diego on 3 November, with Commander W. F. Christie in command. After completing training off Southern California, she sailed for the Far East on March 9, 1956. She arrived at Sasebo on 9 April, and began duty as station repair ship for Service Squadron 3. During the next four years she remained in the Western Pacific, supporting peacekeeping operations of the 7th Fleet. Although based at Sasebo, she steamed to Okinawa, Taiwan, Hong Kong, and to various Japanese ports while carrying out her assigned tasks. Luzon returned to San Diego on May 31, 1960, then steamed to Mare Island on 3 June, for deactivation. She was decommissioned there on July 1, 1960, and her name was struck from the Naval Register on September 1, 1961. Luzon was laid up in the Sassoon Bay Reserve Fleet, Sassoon Bay, California, on August 25, 1960, after being transferred to Maritime Administration. On August 26, 1974, she was sold for $555,625. 50 to Singyong Trading Company, Limited. 
Seoul, South Korea, for scrapping. Luzon received 1 battle stars for her Korean War service. Thanks for watching.